Once upon a time, there are mothers with the power to build worlds with their words. To outsiders, it looked, of course, as if they had no special gift. Just mothers busy making homes, with piles of books beside the couch, and silly children shouting about a great lion or a beloved bride. Where is the power in a mother with her children tucked safely at home? What is the magic of a mother with words? The magic is in the stories. When a mother pauses to read aloud a good story, she builds a world in which she and her children adventure together and return changed. With words, she brings life to the minds and hearts of those who hear them. She extends the alphabet, helping her children think and say truer and lovelier things about reality than they can with only this world at hand. Thus, every child called into the worlds of virtue and nobility leaves with their soul stretched and deepened, with their soul storied. And with these stories etched into their very being, they learn to act, to embody, to play as liturgies acted out again and again until the practice of their play shapes the desires of their hearts. A mother reading is magic because it is holy. She sets apart and points to that which is true, good, and beautiful. She whispers this way. Come further up. Come further in. We've all seen it. After a story, a child stands a little taller, acts a little more courageously, carries themselves with a little more nobility. When a child inhabits another world through story, they see with new eyes. Through Samwise and Lucy, Christian and St. George, they learn the shape of dragons and the sparkle of virtue. They feel the weight of glory, the burden of choice, the ache of hope, and the triumph of goodness. They find children, just like themselves and yet entirely other, fighting, creating, hiding, repenting, becoming, and they know they too can do these things. When a child returns from a story, back to their own home and their own time and place, back on their side of the door, they better understand their own story. They can more clearly see the dragon lurking outside and within, and the path forward because a storied soul knows it must act. It rises to answer the question put before every person. Who will you be in this story? What will you love? For which kingdom will you fight? Will you build worlds with your words? <laughs>